not done with these in forever. I'm on a new camera and I'm really excited. So bear with me. I'm on the, I hope I'm saying this right, but I think it's DG2 Osmo. I'm going to insert a picture so you guys can see it. It's a very cute and discreet little camera and I love it because I was really getting aggravated with filming with my phone. Y'all know how that goes, especially when you pay for the extra storage and it still acts like it doesn't have any storage because I like to have like long footage when I vlog so I didn't want to carry my camera around I like to keep my camera like in a home or a studio type setting so this is the perfect vlog camera and I'm so excited to film on this today we are going to Chateau Elan for my mom's birthday and I'm waiting for my grandma and cousin to arrive at the house and then we will be heading out. But tomorrow I'm just sliced me some apples because I need to eat before going wine tasting. One thing about me, I'm not really like a breakfast person for real. I'm not even an early person for real. Like I low key cannot stand waking up early. Like me just setting an alarm for nine o'clock today on a Saturday morning was a little hard for me. I get very aggravated in the morning because, like I said, I'm just not a morning person, but I'm going to wait for my cousin and grandma to arrive and we will head out. Also, y'all, let's talk about how my wash and goes have been popping lately. I actually just refreshed this wash and go, but the curls give me and I actually picked it out. So I'm probably going to end up washing this out maybe like in the next two days. But I'm just really shocked that my curls are popping like this after, you know, the whole color transformation. I need to go get my roots touched up. But, yeah, I'm going to show y'all all the products I've been using in a separate video. Because there is one $29 product by Curlsmith called that Bond Solve. I think I'm saying it correctly. That has my curls popping. Like, it's better than Alpha G Protein treatment. It's better than Olaplex in my opinion. And it's vegan. So you can't go wrong with the healthy hair treatment. But yeah, I'm gonna show y'all that later, but just wanna show y'all my hair. You wanna All right. a bar like a Say hi grandma. Hey Kayla. No, don't say hey to me, say hey to the people. <laughs> hey to the people. Yeah, this this is my YouTube channel. Oh uh, hello. <laughs> That's my grandma, y'all. They made it. Here's my cousin. Hey. We about to head out. Or we might get Maya a snack, cause you know we can't be drinking on no wine on no empty stomach. That's a no-no. So how are you feeling? I'm feeling great. Let's show them out your outfit. It's my yeah. mom's birthday. birthday. Well, really her birthday is on Monday, but you know we're gonna celebrate a little early, cause nobody celebrates their birthday on Monday. <laughs> <laughs> What's crazy is my birthday falls on Monday this year too. So yeah, and, and does that birthday fall on what? I don't know. Let me see. Tuesday, something like that. Well, Wednesday. Wednesday. Mm-hmm. Nobody got no weekend birthday hard. Yeah. Not well, not well, not this year. It just didn't fall on that this year. But all right, we're about to get on the road. It's an hour and nine minutes from where we are. We are in the suburbs um, of Atlanta. Y'all told us to come early, but we can get him. That's how y'all did it. Yeah, my grandparents live an hour away, so then they had to come up here. And now we're about to head to Brazelton because that's where Chateau Elan is. And that's like North Georgia. So, yeah, let's get on the road. Hi, we made it. Our drive, it was a little traffic, but we are excited. Look at the line. Or vineyard, I should say. Whoop, we all in the middle of the road.
going to do the tropical breeze first. Y'all, I had to change my shoes. My feet were killing me. But we just finished our first wine. And we basically have a ticket here. And the ticket pretty much allows you to have seven wines. And the first one we had was Tropical Breeze. And it's a Muscadine wine. It's pretty good. What would you give this, Maya? Uh, the first uh -huh. one. A five on a scale of ten. I have the same one as y'all. Oh, which one you had? The first one. Oh, she had this one. So next, we're gonna go with the Moscato, and it's the sweet and sparkling with sweet peach and orange finish. So that'll be our second one of choice. Are you gonna get the same one for your second one? Yeah but I'm in love. This is my second time here at Chateau Alain. I came here in July for my best friend's birthday. But that over there is a restaurant. And this is the area. We're getting our wine.
All right, so ladies, we're gonna go around and we're gonna talk and say which one out of the three that we've all tried is your favorite so far and why. So starting with you, Mom. Uh, first of all, I am enjoying myself. Oh, thank you so much. Look at the camera, baby, not me. <laughs> thank you, Kayla. I am enjoying myself. Um, the Moscato is my favorite. Ever. Okay, good choice. Why? Um, because of the sweet tangy. I like the sweet tangy. Okay. Okay. Alrighty. First of all, thank you for inviting me. Of course. Secondly, I like the Prosecco, uh, the root sparkling wine, okay. because it was very crisp and it had an apple-like taste to it. Okay. Um, so that one was my favorite. Awesome. All right, Grandma. Which one was your favorite? The Spagato. The what? Moscato. Moscato. Because it's sweet. Sweet. And I love anything sweet. All but right. Like me. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Maya. Bitter. <laughs> uh, I like the Moscato too. The Moscato? All yeah, right. Yeah, it was sweet. Sweet. Okay. More like juice, like a. A mixture, you know. All right, and I'm gonna go with the Moscato too. I really, really like it because it tastes like juice. <laughs> it tastes like juice, um, and I think I'll probably buy a bottle of that. It's very, very good. I, I do prefer white wine and anything that's like really sweet or has a fruity taste to it. So I'm gonna go with the Moscato. You're enjoying it so far, Mom? I am enjoying myself. Thank All right, you. we are going to dinner at Versailles. It is absolutely gorgeous inside. Get us some food. We had, how many drinks did you have, Mom? Three? I had three. Yeah. The more mature uh, generation, they capped at three for right now to, until we go get dinner. Now, me and my cousin, the Gen Zers, we had four. But yeah, we're about to go get some food on our stomach and then, you know, we might come back and get a little more. But this is how the vineyard looks. Yeah, the little hammock. So cute. That hammock. Yeah. And that's actually the hotel. So we're going inside where they have the dinner inside the hotel. You and Dad definitely need to come back here. It's very cute in there. Straight across. Yeah, go straight across, Mom. Okay. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So go now, and what you do. That's why I'm fine. my love for you. We'll be having dinner tonight, or this evening, I should say. This way. It's absolutely gorgeous in here.
have a reservation for Kayla Moore at 545. Any food allergies, dietary restrictions? No. No. And I see you guys celebrating your birthday? Yes. Birthday. Thank you. It's my mom's yeah. birthday right here. Give us just a moment and we'll get the table set up to you. Alright, thank you. What do you think, Mom? You like the aesthetics in here? It's very pretty. It's nice. Thank you, Kayla. Baby, you don't know to me between me and you i feel a chemistry i won't let no one come and take your place because the love you give you can't be replaced so go now Mom, how you feeling on day two? Great. We're out here in College Park on the Main Street Strip where we're going to be seeing what restaurant we're going to choose for brunch today. Girl, this, this is Atlanta for you. But really, we on the outskirts to be honest. The College Park is south side. But, you know, culture feud fusion. Probably it's all right. We're gonna be lit. We're trying to show y'all. We're trying to show y'all real brunch culture. Let's see which one you want to go to. It's different ones. You can do that if you want to do that. Turn me inside out, out, make my heart beat. Leave no one else, you're all I need. Personality, everything you do. Wow, seafood grits. Pineapple rum, French toast. Thank you. Catfish and grits. Thank you. All right, what do we give that restaurant, Grandma and hey, Mom? It was really nice. I give it a eight. Eight out of ten. Yeah. All right, all right. I give it a eight. Eight out of ten. All right, Maya. Ten. 
10 out of 10 for me. Yeah, 10 out of 10 for the seafood girlies. Um, it was really good. I love brunch culture, y'all. I didn't even get a drink today. Normally, you know what I mean? I, I would more than likely get a drink, but I didn't. The drink was good. Huh? I was saying stop. Mom, please. <laughs> that girl is everything. We're in College Park. I already told them that. They know what's up. They know we knew it. Yes. It was really good brunch today. I loved it. Um, the catfish was really good. And one thing about me, I love grits. I love grits that are like really grainy. Um, I didn't even need to put any salt on it. So that's really, really, really good. And I'm really bad when it comes to over salting my stuff. Salt goes in grits, not sugar. Okay. Let's get, let's get, let's get that through y'all's head. And I'm a Southern girl, you know, girls raised in the South. Grits. All right, we're getting ready to say goodbye to Grandma. Goodbye. Bye. Did you enjoy your birthday weekend, Mom? I did. It was a beautiful weekend. Bye. It wasn't too hot. It wasn't too cold. Yeah. Just and we beautiful. have my brother here in the house. For some reason, my dad went to go pick him up from college. He's letting my dad cut his hair right now. We're going to take him back to campus in a second. <laughs> It's a video. Oh. <laughs>